Hello Leo, welcome to your weekly Twin Flame Love and Romance reading. So, um, you guys, this is for the week of the 25th of April, 2022. So, um, I'm going to have a look now at what I can see um, coming towards you guys. If you'd like a private reading, you can um, visit the description bar down below. Okay. So what's coming in for you? Oh my gosh. All right. So, Leo, your person, they're going to send you so much passion and um, do something for you because they have so much passion, okay? And this person here, they want to offer you a new beginning, okay? This person has so much passion for you. They just want to live this free life and do something very out of the norm just because... <laughs> <clears throat> they're really into you and it's because that's just what they want because they can have it so they're going to make you an offer to you know that is that puts you in your comfort zone that's exactly what you're wanting that's what you were feeling like you that this person was is wanting to give you because you know that's just kind of what you guys like have together okay I feel like that's something that you want to have. This offer is something that you want to get from this person, okay? Now, um, I feel like you had a lot of love from this person. This person was giving you so much love and um, sweet bliss, okay? Because they were following their heart, feeling their feelings, and because this person was expanding in passion, okay? This person, they saw your worth and value, and they were nurturing you, nurturing this connection, okay? And bringing you a lot of sweet bliss, And then I feel like in the distant past, some sort of um, jealousy was removed from this connection. Someone who was jealous, someone who worked behind the scenes, someone who brought about a lot of fears was removed from this connection, okay? Because this person, you know, they needed to see your worth and their worth, all right? So, you know, oh my gosh, this person is having a profound shift in perspective take place this week. That's making this person see your side of the story. And, and see this connection from a different way. Something is also happening in you guys' lives that is making it so this connection just has to work out this way, okay? So there is something going out of you guys' lives that is um, lies, that is not honest, is not truthful, um, so that you guys, and or even someone who, you know, is blocking the truth, your truthful, your reawakening, you know, the rebirth of your connection, they're going out of you guys' way. <clears throat> so that you guys can have um the connection that you guys really want to have together okay because this would make you guys so happy all right so you're gonna get a victory that you always had in the very near future leo with your person that's what i'm seeing here this person is um having a real a rebirth and a renewal of passion for you their confidence is coming back um to them they're being they're validating themselves and validating you okay because this person is cutting ties with negativity and lack okay they were dealing with separatists and um, separationists and this person is letting go of these people okay 
um, who betrayed them as well because this person just wants their wish fulfillment all right now um, a lot of people are helping to work this connection out and to work together with your person you know by safeguarding your emotions and safeguarding your person's emotions from negativity like by not dumping all over your person or, and dumping all over um, this connection people around you guys are not doing that and they're cooperating with your person they're giving them money they're supporting them they're also um, supporting this connection financially so like people at work giving them a job you know so that they can take care of the two of you guys you know because these people have had a profound shift in their life where they've realized that that's what they should do okay so I really feel like your person, they're hoping that everything will work out for you guys, okay? Um, they're hoping that you guys will reconcile, um, come out of being trapped in fear, come make your own decisions for your own lives, you know, instead of doing things how, the way they should be, doing things the way that you guys want it to be for you guys. This person, they're going to get their confidence back. They were always second guessing and doubting and... They're cutting ties with, um, uh, like, lack-minded, argumentative, you know, chastisement, um, argumentative, bombastic sort of energy. They're cutting ties with this, especially not bringing this to you guys, you know, not bringing this to your connection anymore. You know, not seeing your connection like this. This person, like, brings this energy, and they're not, they're overcoming this by choosing to have a rebirth in optimism, an optimistic spark, optimistic flair. And also by getting their confidence back for themselves. You know, they're not dealing with negativity no more. Mm. So, yeah, they're going to be having so much passion for you, okay? You're definitely going to be dealing with an optimistic person that is very sexual and, um, you know, lustful, but also optimistic that just goes for what they want and gets what they want, is receiving an exorbitant and disgusting amount of attention, growth, um, success even it's like they're receiving so much of it because they're just embracing themselves so much um and you know this person is just seeing this connection for what it really is and and um accepting it for what it is and so that's why they're making you this offer well that's not why that's the offer that they're making you is to you know stay comfortable and to you know this person just wants to offer you comfort because of something that's going on between the two of you guys that you guys are keeping a secret and also something that is to come in the future that's why this person is offering you this level of comfort and material harvest because you deserve it and they loved you they were always loving on you Leo okay because you have so much value because you nurture them okay and because they nurture themselves so that's you know that's why they are so loving because they take care of themselves because you know you match their energy they have a lot of sexual passion for you you guys are great um in bed together and that's what they love about being with you you're great you're great in bed together um that's not the only thing that they love about you but that's one of the things okay i do feel like there is some jealousy envy um some elusivity emotionally elusive folks as well involved in the situation that cause confusion this person they're going to get victory over being confused about this and understand this. Ooh. This person is just surrendering to the reality of the situation, but I feel like it wasn't like this person was in denial. It was like this person just didn't understand the truth. They had lies. Okay. And now that they're getting the truth, you know, they're, they're just accepting what things are and um, coming in get to giving you their truth bringing you happiness, concluding an emotional cycle with you. And, you know, it's because this person wants to travel with you. They want to do fun things together. They want to have happiness. They don't want to be stuck in the lurky, dark, muddy oceans. They just want to be together. They just want to protect your connection and be happy together. Okay? So they're really hoping that you guys can come together and reconcile and have a union of hearts on this matter. You know, and even perhaps no longer even have trouble with this, you know, or just so that, you, you know, they're hoping that this situation goes away forever. But I definitely feel like this person is hoping that, you know, you um, can start like start to see their side 
and they you guys can and they can start to see your side more and more because you know they also understand that you know your side needs to be seen as well like it's not just um their side. it's not just one person's side you know it's, there's a reckon there's a, like a union of hearts that this person is hoping takes place that's why it's like called a union of hearts okay so what goddesses are with you guys in your connection this week like bringing about good things good energy a lot of goddesses want to come forth i usually only take three but many have come forth so we have madame soleil so she's an optimistic positive goddess we also have the dragon goddess she's fiery af um with Quan yin okay very compassionate and then we have urania mm -hmm. and then we have the energy because sometimes we just have goddess energy or god energy and we have the energy of orepheus and or Orepheus, or, or Orepheus, or uh, that's what I call Orepheus, and Eurydice, okay? And this is the energy of not going back, like when spirit says, don't look back, don't look back, okay? And you guys are learning to stop looking back when, you know, you've been given an opportunity to move forward from a situation that's heavy and get what you want, but provided you just don't do something in particular, you know, you guys are going to come out of a habit of just, of doing it even though you don't want to do it or even though you're being told to do it just because it's just like a habit so it's like it's a habit but it's a habit that it costs you something so grim i mean because of this this is just a story right that this is the story of Eurydice and um and Orpheus. it costs you something so grim you know but it was like you know it was something so small and it's something that you just do and it's small but you do it all the time but it makes a big habit Okay, so you guys are going to come out of this by just not looking back. Just don't look back. That's the energy <coughs> of your connection this week. And then you're going to be, you know, dealing with the goddess Urania. She's going to be helping with your perception, truth, honesty, enlightenment, wisdom, um, perception. Um, and also like just being analyzed, seeing things, analyzing things, you know analyzing things for your connection for yourself okay analyzing the truth of people as well and when it comes to toxic folks there's a fiery wall of protection going up around you to safeguard you from these people's energy and there's also the goddess Kuan Yin protecting you and mainly bringing you compassion and giving you compassion for yourself and helping you to have compassion for others but for yourself you know you got to have some compassion for yourself Leo as well and that's what she's going to be bringing you um, and protecting you, you know, as well. Like, people are not going to want to come near you to mess with you. And then we also are dealing, Leo, you guys, with Madame Solo, who is very positive, optimistic, fiery, bright. She's dancing, so your connection is bright and fiery, dancing, optimistic. Everything is working out. It's a, lots of celebratory energy. I feel like you guys together will make, will have lots of parties, you know, will be very so like bombastic coupling on on are that way and she's bringing you the spirit if you've never had it if you've had it before she's bringing it back you know you know so you guys can be happy together and you know jovial this is beautiful gorgeous now on to the lenormand All right. Wow. So you guys, you guys are dealing with a man who is very passionate about you and he's very honest. Okay. He is very passionate and he is extremely honest. So just like, um, just like, Le just like Aries, right? You guys pick a number one, two or three and ask a question and, um, the corresponding cards are the answers. Okay. So, this is from this particular oracle deck. But the corresponding oracle card will be your message. Okay, so this is for number one, number two, and number three. I kind of like thought I messed up. I think I did. I'm not sure. But this is card number one, two, or three. You can't mess up during a reading, you guys. Alright, so if you chose number one, the answer is reconsider. Okay. 
If you chose card number two, the answer is helpful people will help you. And if you chose number three, meditation brings answers. Okay, Leo, this is your weekly <laughs> reading. Um, I'll talk to you guys all next week. Um, enjoy your twin flames.